have an eye eye tube it's abla so this video is about strong women in community and family and specifically us black women you know us melanated persons and our true strength uh, a sister asked me recently about initiation processes if i've ever heard like about women going through certain initiation processes that um, involves women kind of being alone in the wild and doing survival things in that way how we see sometimes males when they're going through initiation processes they go into the wild maybe they have to hunt down a lion or do something like that to display strength i was asked if i've ever heard of women doing things like that but on the god tenant women's initiation processes and things like that do display strength but not in that manner so yes we are strong women everybody knows that but not strong in that sense where we must compete with males and the male definition and how males exemplify strength for example physically a male just the anatomy of a male is to be stronger and bigger than a female um, what is this called sexual dimorphism I believe it's called um, male are just designed physically to be stronger than the female however a woman a female can withstand, uh, withstand and have a stronger pain tolerance a level of pain tolerance than a male so you see how we are both strong vessels but in different manners so a females role and say female initiation processes deal with strength in a manner that allows her to be valuable to the family within her position. So strength in being a leadership to her children and other women, but not strength in a way that would create leadership in her mind where she thinks she must compete with males. I see a lot in the world that women are starting to, well, not just starting, but <laughs> have begun to compete with males and it's really just us women that think we're competing with males, but to be honest, males only really recognize other males as competition. They don't recognize females as competition. Um, maybe when the male is also in balance and maybe in a workplace, you know, jobs and things of the world, they will see females as competition, but in reality, males recognize other males as competition and view them on a similar level of strength. So us females, we never need to try and compete or be initiated or do the things we see males do because we want to appear strong. Because we must remain in the strength of our position and our role. And when we are in that role and in that position and embody just what is natural for us, what is a natural display of strength for a female, that's when there's balance. That just got me thinking that us females we don't need to compete with males and try and go hunt down a line to display strength we need to display strength and display display strength in our role as women in our surrender to the most high as males display strength in their surrender to the most high in their way so females should do it in our way and when everyone remains in their roles and remains balanced that's when that's when everything is balanced <laughs> so it's kind of become like a power struggle between male and female because females are trying to compete in that male way, trying to gain acknowledgement in a male masculine manner. It's important for females to remain in our role and remember to never try to compete with the male for strength because we are strong and valuable within our role. So we mustn't become confused and imbalanced in trying to take over the male role. And this is why just families are destroyed because um, everyone is imbalanced, the male and the female, having different ideas, being overly masculine, being overly feminine. We've lost our balance and that's why we're having challenge as quote unquote black people with maintaining family and the importance of family. So yeah, as females, we need to Remember to excel in our roles. We don't have to try and take another's role or 
excel in another way we should excel in the way that is natural for us and not go against the grain and try to do what is unnatural um, and I know some persons can feel that they've been forced to uh, compete with males or be a mother and a father be a male uh, and a female because of the world but that's exactly why we need to come out of the world so when we come out of the world then we can excel in our position and relax into our position as female um so yeah we just need to come out the world that's the solution because i know many people will argue like they have to do this to live in the world um yeah but that's today's this is what i wanted to share today i hope everyone is having a blissful day god i hear like bro i i like